Hi. <laughs> Hi, guys. I'm out and about. But I wanted to come live really quickly because I'm reading a lot of the comments on the thread that I just posted um, with the information that's in there. And I totally understand. I just want to let everyone know, like, um, I, <laughs> I don't post stuff like that. Like, you're never seeing me post, you know, by the way, um, I have a source who said blah, 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 blah. Like, you're not seeing me do that. Um, I don't usually do it. I talk to a lot of people. Um, and I don't usually post threads like that, but this one in particular, um, whatever you feel about the situation and what's happening, this one in particular, I felt really comfortable and, and I felt comfortable sharing that with you because of the person who wrote it. And, um, I just wanted to put that out there. So there's a lot of people that are saying now we have to wait and reelect him to get this stuff done. That's not what it says. Um, I want everybody to read it very closely and very carefully. There were some people critiquing because the person who shared said the Ukraine instead of Ukraine, which I understand. I do it myself accidentally all the time. I start to say the Ukraine and I say Ukraine after. And this person was very clear. They're not an insider. So take that for what it's worth. And again, if I felt comfortable enough to share it, I stand behind everything there. Um, and I don't usually do that. And it is not, you know, to me personally, I'm comfortable sharing it flat out. So I'm good. I, I'm, trust me, <laughs> this was uh, what, I don't know, 10, seven to 10 days ago, way before I got this way before any of this stuff with Biden started happening. And it was frustrating me because I'm screaming, guys, pay attention to this, this, and this. And I'm knowing like in the back of my head what this person has told me and that I can't share it, which I, I always value and take very seriously. If somebody comes to me with information and says, please don't share this with anybody, I don't. And I have permission to share. And I did. You can take that um, however you wish. You know, you can trust it or not. It's fine. In any case, it's out there. And if, you know, if if nothing happens, then that's going to be on me for sharing it. And I am I am comfortable taking that. So that should tell you, if you know me by now, that should tell you everything you need to know. I. That's all I can say. <laughs> so if you guys are joining me now late, um, there is a thread on my Twitter account that I wrote um, from somebody who had sources inside who met with them recently and was cleared to give some information. So I shared it. And as I said, again, I'm very comfortable sharing it. And that's basically what I'll say about that. So I just wanted to give you guys a, a complete disc. Like I, I, I'm not giving a disclaimer. What I'm trying to say is I understand. I wish I could take these off so I could see you, but, um, I understand where you are. Like, I get it. I understand people who are like, Oh, this is bullshit. I don't believe any of this. I get it. I, I know. I know how it is. Trust me. I know how it is. You see all this stuff and you're like, woohoo. And you get all excited. And then you're like, oh, that will never, that never happened. I mean, that's been me, gosh, a hundred thousand times, at least a hundred thousand times. So I understand that perspective. I'm not angry at anybody who feels that way. Uh, it's fine. I'm not going to take it personally. Trust. It's okay. Like, I just want to let everyone know, like, I totally understand that perspective. I totally understand the perspective of being eye rolly about it, right? So I get it. Um, and again, it's okay. Like, it's okay. I totally get it. Like, I'm one of those people. <laughs> so I get it. Um, and anyway, that's all I really wanted to say. I am, uh, I'm sitting um, at a birthday party and I'm about to go um, to this birthday party. So the whole Ukraine thing that's going on right now strikes at the core of all this. And we're like, I'm, I'm kicking because if this would have just gone according to schedule, then it would have been a lot easier for folks to validate the rest of it because none of this was happening then. 
um, patience is hard right now. Yes, it is absolutely hard. If any of you guys listen to my podcast today, you will hear that. You will hear that patience is hard. <laughs> I'm with all of you. I'm one of you guys. I totally get it. I totally get it. So um, that's that. Very busy behind the scenes. Lots of stuff going on. Lots of information coming from goodness knows how many directions. Um, it is a beautiful thing. At the same time, it is crazy town. It is fiery. It is confusing. It's hard to navigate everything. It's, 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 a, it's a wild animal's pen, straight up. Um, and we're coming to a point, like I said on the podcast today, we're at a point where like, there's no reason for this reaction. There's no reason for this reaction that we're seeing if the hammer wasn't about to fall. They would have literally no reason to be reacting this way. No reason. And I'm trying to do my best to kind of discern through all of this stuff for you guys, help as best as I can. And um, the last IG report was the Comey report. Um, the mid-year exam report was 15 months ago. There is a project that is just being completed on Uncover DC right now that we're getting ready to roll out, which is really amazing. It is, um, it, it, thank you to Rich Perry, to all of the volunteers who stepped forward to help with this because we've been working on it behind the scenes. I mean, Rich has run this thing. I, it's been a, a godsend to have him running the show, but we have, um, and it'll be completely released for all of you guys to see as soon as we make it interactive, but we have a complete timeline of all of the official, official government released stuff. And it paints some pictures that uh, someone's asking where Jeff is at. I'm not sure. He disappears sometimes for a little while. Um, not really sure where he's at right now. I, I sent him a DM a couple of days ago and I haven't gotten the response yet. Um, anyway, I wanted to hop on here and tell everyone that I totally understand doubt about it or, you know, saying, oh, here we go again. Just another person saying the hammer is going to drop and nothing happens. I totally understand. We won't know, even me, even though I'm, I'm very confident, very confident about this thread that I did. Time is only going to tell. So I just put it out there again because I felt very comfortable doing so. Didn't have a second thought, a doubt, a question. Um, as you know, again, it is not something that I normally do ever. Uh, I'm going to say, as I begin to build. It will be like you follow. <laughs> I'll just keep talking. I'm about to cut it short anyway. I just wanted to let you guys. Is that better? Is that better? Can you hear me now? I'll wait a second. Okay. Um, okay. So I just want to say basically what I said, basically, basically, basically the entire time. <laughs> And for me to hop on live like this, trust me, <laughs> trust me, <laughs> this is not something I like to do. Okay. Um, we're in rough times. It's not going to get easier anytime soon. It is going to get worse. It is going to get harder to deal with. It is going to be 
painful. They're not going to go down without this not. Just did. Was so desperate. So desperate and so horrible and so disgusting that you can tell if, if you follow this stuff, you can totally tell what's going on. It was a glorified leaker, an illegal leak who tried to use the whistleblower protections to save themselves. That's what this was. And the New York Times, the New York Times giving everybody clues to who it was is only because this backfired on them in such spectacular fashion. Such spectacular fashion. The only reason why the New York Times amongst thieves. Literally none. They got bad information. They got a barium meal. And now they're outing the level of loyalty you've got in the play with your emotions that is not what i'm about but i long time you know where that comes from and why i did it so that's about it have a beautiful friday i'm gonna go to this birthday party and i will talk to you guys very soon if i can shut this off this always happens here <laughs> bye guys